Hey guys, how's it going? So welcome to today's video slash stream. You're live. Um, this is our April pickups. We do these live on Twitch, guys. So if you want to catch one of these live, be sure to go drop me a follow on Twitch. It's BigZ underscore games. Link is below. Uh, if not, you can just watch it on YouTube. That's fine too. Um, but these things will be a little bit slower paced because I'll be talking to you guys as we go. I'm just gonna get everything set up before we start. So, I said March was the craziest month for pickups ever. Well, I think we've just outdone ourselves again. April was insane! Oh my god. Started with that massive PS1 lot we, get, we got. It finished with that big PS2 lot. There was so much in April. Like, I can't believe how much game, how many games I picked up. No wonder I've got no fucking money. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, like, I sold so much stuff that, yeah, I bought so much for my collection. Okay, this will be fun. Um, so, if I make my OBS a certain way, I can see myself. That I can make the background like a white screen. Oh, right. So I'm gonna start with some Nintendo stuff I picked up. Um, so I got a Switch game. We got Super Mario 3D All Stars Switch. Uh, I played this. Not my copy. I played this at Grant's house. Uh, I haven't got a Switch yet. Oh, that reminds me. I actually got something else for the Switch, which I'm gonna grab right now. Yeah, one of my buddies at work hooked me up with a Switch box. So shout out to Josh for this. Like in pristine condition, so I can find a um, incomplete Switch and have it complete. It's got all the inserts, etc. I also got this amazing. Box Nintendo 2DS XL Mario Kart 7 recently installed. It's like white and orange. It's really cool. I'm just gonna show you guys quickly. Here's the console, it's super cool. Yeah, it's real pretty. Now we're gonna try and put it away. <laughs> Alright, we got it. So I've been deeply into the Nintendo side of things, mainly just like Nintendo Switch, Pokemon games. I guess we got a 2D, 2DS now. Um, I actually picked up another 2DS yesterday, but I am gonna sell that one. I don't need two of them. If it was a 3DS, I might have kept it. Um, but I did get a couple of Pokemon games. We got Pokemon Moon on the 3DS, probably the cheapest Pokemon game. Nothing too special. However, we did get something pretty special. Now this actually hasn't got the game in it, but it's complete with the manual and all the inserts minus the game. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team on the Game Boy Advance. And tonight I bought a copy of the game for $29. Um, so yeah, I've ended up getting a complete copy for $59. Where this sells for about $150 to $200 complete, so that'd be pretty cool. Um, I won't be selling it though, I'm collecting Pokemon. <laughs> Yeah, but if I can do it cheap like that, I'll definitely continue collecting Pokemon for sure. 
And I'm so shout out to Tristan for this. We've got the SingStar starter pack box set. So this has got the game and the microphone. The only box SingStar starter pack one I've got, so that's pretty cool. And uh, we'll do some PS3 games now. Steelbooks and slipcovers. Uh, so we got a little upgrade here. We ended up finding a sealed copy of Batman Arkham City. Back in the collection. Again from Tristan, we got FIFA 11. Now this is the... Drop it a your butt. Team cover. Um, from Christian, we've got a PS4 steelbook. This is the PlayStation steelbook. Really cool. Didn't come with a game, it just came by itself. There were a couple more released in Australia, which I have as well. Yeah, um, some PS3 games, guys. We got a, a Platinum Motor Storm. An Essentials Bioshock Infinite. This spine looks really cool because it's a little bit different for all the other essential spines. Uh, Batman Free Beyond Gotham. And it has this exclusive content, Batman of the Future DLC pack inside. Yeah, my copy didn't have that so that was cool. I just picked this up without realizing it when I was going through all the games. I realized that it had that sticker on it. Uh, so coinciding the new game coming out. I got this before the new game came out and the price has gone up. So that was very good timing. Um, it is the Japanese near replicant. Uh, I, I got this off my buddy... Um, Leonardo, so shout out to Leonardo for that. Um, he held it for me actually like six months ago and I just, yeah, I didn't buy it. And uh, He wasn't able to ship to Australia and when he finally was, I decided to purchase it. And yeah, so this is the same version that is on PS4 with the young brother, not the father. Yeah, I picked up this in a lot and it's actually a cover variant. So it's Game of Thrones, it's a slightly different cover to my version of a power version. Also let me know in the comments if you have this version or another version if you're in the power rage. Or in the stream if you're watching that. Again, another game I picked up and didn't realise, but it is a different fighter on the front. We've got Fight Night Champion. Smoke weed every day. Hey, hey, Missy. Hey, guys. Oh, Lord. So as you can see, there are different fighters on the front. So that's pretty cool. Dylan, how about you? Oh, yeah, I'm good, Missy. Just showing you guys my pickups for last month. Was that a raid? Messy with the host, let's go baby. Hell yeah. How are you been, Missy? You good? You're home, obviously. Here we have Painkiller, Hell, and Damnation. Now this is the cut version. Not uncut, cut. Meaning it's got content deleted out of it. <laughs> That's Germany for you. Now again, the SingStar starter pack we got from Tristan. This is the game. Um, Kevin hooked me up with the ultimate pack from Portugal, which is called Nova Grecia. Shout out to Kevin for that. And another game from Christian. We've got the FIFA 15 BVB edition. I just realized I forgot a game. I'll be right back. Oh, my God. 
<laughs> Sorry, guys. Like, I do this with all the photos I've got on my phone, but it's, when you pick up 200 games in a month, you I'm good, yeah, home now, home permanently, some stuff went wrong with work. Oh no. Oh fair enough. You're able to get more work though back home right missing. Um so this is near your place, Missy, I guess. Well not really, it's Vancouver, Oregon. So I got this from Double Jump Video Games, it is Deadly Premonition, the classified edition, and it is factory sealed. It did come with the cards too, the cards are in another room, I'm not gonna go get them. And Kevin helped me out with some Lego packs, so shout out to Kev for these. So we got Lego Harry Potter, years 5 to 7, boxed with the Lego pieces. Thanks, Missy. Um, this one is sealed, and it is Lego Batman 3 Beyond Gotham, with the Lego piece, boxed. And these are pretty hard to find, especially in Australia. We got Batman 2, DC Superheroes, the Lego pieces. Another sealed one, we have Lego the movie, the video game, with the Lego pieces. And it's got a free child ticket to LEGO MAN! <sighs> you reckon I can dress up as a child and sneak in? Yeah, I just want one ticket to Lego Land. I got a free one. I'm not gonna open it. You can just like take it out of the box. Sir, you do need to open it. No! I'll just buy a ticket. <laughs> another sealed one, The Hobbit. And another ticket to Lego Land. Let's go, baby. And it to got a toy too. They all have toys. Like a Jurassic World. And Lego Lord of the Rings. Alright, Miss here, I'm gonna ask you. Would you like to see PS1, PS2, or PS4 next? Yes, you can pick. One, two, or four. PS1, baby! Oh, shit! Alright. I don't need to say this, you guys can stay with but... Five explanation point O's is right. <laughs> All right, I need to show you some quickly because I can't see chat at the moment. So, let's go back to story time why there's so many PS1 games. So the guy was selling some Nintendo games, like old Nintendo games on Facebook, and I just said, 
Have you got any PS1 uh, PlayStation games? And he messaged me with photos and photos of PS1 games. So I went around there and made him an offer and we made a deal. I ended up buying 150 for 600 bucks. Anyway, I kept like 57 or something, 47, 50, I don't know, however many I show you guys. Um, and I've sold probably like half of the rest. I've already made the money back and now it's just making profit. But yeah, all these were free because of how I bought them and sold them. And that's done in less than four weeks, guys. So if you want to um, see how I did that, there is a video on my channel. I'll leave a link in the description. Um, if you're watching on Twitch, be sure to go check out my YouTube because I put up that video like two weeks ago. Anyway, here we go, guys. We have FIFA 99. Now, almost all these games are complete. There's maybe like three or four that aren't. They're all black label copies and I didn't own them. So this is pretty cool. We have Shrek Treasure Hunt. I haven't taken off all the stickers. Some of them need a bit of work, a bit of loving. We will get to it eventually. Um, I'll let you guys know the expensive and the rarer games, etc. We have the Dukes of Hazard. Hardcore 4x4. Mizzy, you're gonna like this one. Tomb Raider 2. Time Crisis Project Titan. Ah, oh, damn, the blue face drop. <laughs> <clears throat> Jeremy McGrath Freestyle Motocross. Agent Armstrong. Here we have a Tom Clancy Rainbow Six. Tom Clancy Rainbow Six Rogue Spear double pack. I like these double packs. Aladdin, um, in Nasira's Revenge. Now this next one's like a hundred, hundred and fifty dollar game, so it's pretty cool. It is Jackie Chan, Stuntmaster. Now this next one's like a sixty dollar game, and that's Crash Bash. Which I'm sure you guys all know. And this next one's like 50. We have the Namco Museum Volume 2. Uh, the next one's over $100. It is Resident Evil Director's Cut. Love that one. Which one, Missy? Here we have London Racer 2. Fade to Black. Crash, yeah, me too. Chill. FIFA 2001. Mary Kate and Ashley Magical Mystery Mall. G Police. Lego Racers. Disney Dinosaur. Dinosaurs. Superstar Dance Clue number one hits.
Quite mania 3D. Tenchuch 2. Here we have the original Tekken. Really happy with this one. Tekken's one of my favorite series. I still need to get Tekken 2, 3, and 4 for the PS2. Here we have Street Fighter 2 collection. RC Revenge. Spec Ops, Airborne Commando. Um, I got this one from work, I believe. And it is Wing Commander. Star Wars Rebel Assault 2. Spec Ops Covert Assault. Medal of Honor. And here's one I got from Kevin. This is one of the picks of the month. It's amazing. It is the Grand Theft Auto Collector's Edition. I'm going to pull it out and show you guys. It has a good slip cover. So, yeah, oh, I don't want to pull it all out because it'll be hard to get back in. So it comes with Grand Theft Auto 1, Grand Theft Auto London 1969, and Grand Theft Auto 2. All in this dual, beautiful jewel case, and this is in perfect condition. So thanks Kev for selling me this one. Probably going to live in my collection knowing that it was yours. And we're not done, baby. We still going. Alone in the dark, the new nightmare. Fisherman's bait free. Cyber Tiger. MDK. Double O seven tomorrow never dies. Missy, you're gonna have to let me know. Do you wanna see PS2 or PS4 next? Two or four. Now this next one I was super stoked to get because I really wanted the black label. It's one of my favorite PS1 games. And that is Worms. She's locked in PS2. Got WWE Smackdown 2. <clears throat> Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. Apocalypse of Bruce Willis. The Rally. Cool Borders 2. Adidas Power Soccer 1998 Ridge Racer Type 4 Ridge Racer Saltwater Sport Fishing Motor Racer Start Your Engines Player 1 Toe ball, number one. I think this is an RPG. Oh no, it's a fighting game. 
And WW double oh seven, the world is not enough. WWE James Bond! James Bond comes out! No, he shut the bar! <laughs> Alrighty, Missy asks for PS2 games. PS2 games, you're gonna get. You're not gonna get any PS2 game. You're gonna get top notch quality JRPGs, fighting games, only the best here. So before we start, I need to give Jared a shout out. Jared contacted me on Facebook and he told me he was selling some of his PS2 games. I'm like, yeah, yeah, radio. Right, yeah. And then he showed me photos and I was like, I had to like keep picking up my jaw from the ground. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm gonna show you these guys. Most of them from Jared. Um, a few of them I picked up here and there. Um, I'll let you guys know if I'll just show you them. It doesn't really matter where I got them. Yeah, I mean, here we have London Cab Challenge. Kill Zone. We start the JRPGs. We've got Sudoken 4. Red Dead Revolver. Dynasty Warriors 5. Valkyria Profile 2. Warriors Orochi The original Half-Life Samurai Warriors 2 Empires Oops Here we have Breath of Fire Dragon Quarter Dragon Quest, The Journey of the Cursed King. EverQuest. Grandia 2. Champions of Norath. Baldur's Gate, Dark Alliance 2. Castlevania. The Bouncer. Capcom's Classics Collection. Summoner 2 and Summoner 1 Star Wars Battlefront The Paperback Shadow of the Colossus Star Ocean till the end of time. One Piece Grand Battle. Tenshu Wrath of Heaven. Haven. Way of the Samurai 2. Seven Blades.
I need me chef free. I know miss you too. Sword of the Samurai. Zone of the Enders. Gladiator, Sword of Vengeance. Shadow of Rome. Pirates, The Legend of the Black Cat. Maximo and Maximo Army of Zeal. Uh, Ten dot oh 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 bullets. Lego Indiana Jones. Oh, these are just some other pickups I got. Lego Batman. We got the Wally slipcover. Now these are two eBay purchases. Or one was an eBay purchase. One was off Facebook and I actually got another game from. So we have Odin Spear. We have Cold Fear. And the one I'm really excited about, Dragon Guard 2. So those are our PS2 pickups. Uh, what were you more excited about, Missy? The one or two games, I'll both be say. For me, um, uh, I, I can't even, but the quality of the PS2 games are just insane, but I never get PS1 games, but it's hard to split hairs, it's just like it was, they're both insane, it's so hard for me to get PS1 games in that condition, like they mightn't have been the quality of these PS2 games, but wow, yeah, by the way, anyway, we'll get to PS4 next. Metal Gear Solid and Crash sucked me into PlayStation. That's good. Like many others. Messi was screaming, Snake! Snake! Alright, so we don't have a hundred PS4 games like we did last month. Obviously we couldn't have with the amount of PS1 and 2 we picked up, but we still got a very nice lot. So another one from Christian, again the BVB edition, Bryce Dortmund, FIFA 16. Shayo Nare Wild Pearls or something. Obscure, I'll buy it. <laughs> uh, I got a sealed Doom 3 VR edition. Had a pretty low print, so I'd pick that up if you see it. We got Pyro Pyro Tetris 2. Nine Monkeys of Shalon. Planet Coaster console edition. I got Disney's Aladdin and Lion King double pack. We've got Sword Art Online. Um, Al Cis Tion Lycoris. That's a good one. Which one, Missy? Aladdin? 
I thought it's really hard. <laughs> oh no, it's the Lion King's really hard. Knights of Azura 2, Bride of the New Moon. I am trying to collect JRPG, so there are a few in here. Just Dance 2020. Oh, you got it for the Switch? Nice. Here's one that's growing up in price like crazy, so pick it up if you can see it. <clears throat> it is the uh, Danganronpa Trilogy. The PS4 it does include Danganronpa uh, 1 and 2, 3, or 1, 2, and 3. 1 and 2 is technically one game on the PS4. Uh, here we have a limited run game, Celeste. One I've been after for a while, I got it off a Facebook group in America. Now, one I'm playing at the moment, it's amazing, near Replicant. Now, there is an issue with my, I think it's my capture card, but like sound's not working. I thought it was the monitor, I changed monitors and the other one wasn't working. So I've narrowed it down to like one or two things. Hopefully it's not the capture card, but I'll work it out. Still my YouTube videos, so it's all good. Here we have Everybody's Golf, the VR edition. Devil May Cry 5 with the sleeve. Sonic Forces, and this is the bonus edition. Battlefield 1. Takedan 2, like a monster fighting game, looks pretty cool. Sleeping Dogs, the definitive edition. Ukulele. Monopoly, family fun pack. Ben 10. Here we have a factory sealed Formula One 2020, the 70 edition. And I got a sealed Cyberpunk bonus collectibles pack. Now this has got the steelbook inside it, but I'm going to keep this sealed. So that, guys, concludes my April 2021 video game pickups. That was crazy. Um, there's no way I'm going to match this in May. Um, like, absolutely no way. Thanks, Missy. But yeah, this was absolutely insane. I do have a few pickups planned for May, but nothing on this scale. Uh, again, thanks for watching everyone on Twitch. If you're watching on YouTube, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I'll try and get this video out today. We'll go raid someone before I leave, guys. Thanks for watching, Missy. Um, I'm gonna go raid a big streamer, but he's really cool. His name's Has vs RPG. He's playing Kingdom Come Deliverance, and he's getting real into it. So let's go check Has out. So I'll see you guys later. Um, everyone on Twitch, everyone on YouTube. Thanks for watching. I've been Figsy. You've been good. And we'll see you guys next time. <laughs>